SAF Volunteer Corps is a uniformed volunteer scheme allowing more Singaporeans and permanent residents to participate in national defence. We have had a diversity of volunteers that have put their applications in to be interviewed. I've had doctors, nurses, radiographers, I've had lawyers, I have teachers, I have students of course. All these people were different in their backgrounds from their countries of origins, but they all wanted to serve Singapore because this is where they are. People who have finished 18-year-olds, 20-year-olds who have finished the training tell me that they become more resilient as a result of SAFVC training. And that's a good thing. Volunteers can contribute in fields such as engineering, information, legal, maritime, medical, psychology and security. Well, I mostly just did it um, for, to make an example for my kids since they'll have to eventually serve an S when they grow up. So this way I'll have a sort of a example to show them and stories to share with them. I decided to join the SAF Volunteer Corps because Singapore is a home for me and if you call some place home, you would want to defend it and you would want to contribute to it. This is good that she can contribute and uh, she can serve the nation uh, also, uh, you know, be part of this defence team. I hope to learn life skills, uh, discipline, make new friends with the people here. I guess it's more the moral support, like uh, assuring her that everything is going to be okay. For two weeks, volunteers will undergo basic training to acquire basic soldiering skills and military values. During the course, volunteers are trained in a safe and progressive manner. As part of this, regular water parades are held to keep volunteers hydrated during their training. Progressive aerobic and strength training are required to lay the foundations for the rest of their training. So this is the first time they are doing the 5BX and uh, I'm, I'm quite glad to see that they are actually able to run through the whole thing. Volunteers will then proceed to learn basic foot drills. Buddy aid skills are also crucial as the volunteers are trained in CPR and AED which ensure that they are prepared for emergencies. A national education program is conducted to make volunteers more aware of the importance of national defence and develop a sense of belonging and rootedness to Singapore. You get a sense of what you want to protect now, you know, you appreciate uh, what has been done before. Coming up next, get ready to join our volunteers in Episode 2 where they learn to fire the SAR-21.